Welcome back to another video. So today is a really exciting day. My protein is gonna be collaborating with Mike and I candy, which when I was little, I was obsessed with. I love the Mike and I candy. So the package is outside. Let's grab it and let's get to cooking, baby. Dude, I think the package is here. Boom! Awesome, awesome boxing. And it comes with a really cool shaker. Uh, we're gonna use today the Mike and Ike Sour Screaming Sour Cherry flavor, which I'm really pumped for. It comes with a few of these in the packs as well that you can mix after a workout. Let's get to making this recipe. It's gonna be really good. Here are a few of the things we're gonna need today. One is our topper, which is gonna be our Sour Mike and Ike candies. Two, you're gonna need a little bit of lemon. You're gonna need two cups of ice cubes. Then we're gonna come over and have a little bit of honey here. And of course, you're gonna need your My Protein Mike and Ike Sour Clear Away Isolate. And last but not least, you're gonna need three cups of pitted cherries. These I got frozen at my local grocery store, so you can grab the same thing. Um, I think it's a little bit easier to grab frozen ones just because they blend really nice and it can make a really nice Italian ice. You're also gonna need a food processor or some sort of blender. Let's just kick this thing off. First, let's add our three cups of pitted cherries. Next, we're gonna add our two cups of ice. We're gonna add one tablespoon of fresh lemon juice. Add a half tablespoon of honey. And last, let's not forget about our Mike and Ike Sour Clearway Isolate. So we're gonna add two scoops of this. And, obviously it needs power. So we're done blending, you're gonna grab yourself a meatloaf tray or some kind of baking tin. So right now we're using a bread tin and then we're gonna freeze this up after you pour it in, probably for about three to four hours. That way it's nice and icy. And bam, there you have it. We just topped it with our little Mike and Ike sour candies on top. And that's what you get when you're done. What's going on everyone? My name is Asil Suede and in this video, I'm gonna take you all through how to make a strawberry protein popsicle recipe. This is going to be super easy, just a few steps. So make sure you follow along, but here are the ingredients that you are going to need. So you're gonna need some clear whey isolate, the Mike and Ike original fruit strawberry flavored, which has just been released from my protein. Of course, you are going to need two pounds of fresh ripe strawberries along with some popsicle sticks, some aluminum foil, and some clear cups, or you could use a popsicle molder if you have one as well. And then also, of course, some Mike and Ike candies. But anyways, guys, let's go ahead and get started. I'll show you all exactly how to make these strawberry protein popsicles. So what we need to do next is cut the tops off of all the washed strawberries along with cutting them into halves. So after a few quick minutes, we've got all the strawberries cut in halves. We're gonna go ahead and put all these strawberries into the blender. After all the strawberries are inside the blender, you are going to need to add one scoop of My Protein and Mike Nike Original Fruit Strawberry Flavored Clear Whey Isolate, which is amazing. It's only got 80 calories with 20 grams of protein. So go ahead and insert one scoop with all the strawberries. Now this is where the magic happens. Go ahead and blend up all the strawberries with the protein powder until you get a puree consistency. Before I put the puree in here, I'm actually gonna insert a few sliced strawberries inside just so they freeze up into the puree. Put a couple of sliced strawberries in here and then I'm gonna go ahead and insert more once we have the puree inside the cup. So I'll go ahead and pour all of the cups until they are full with the puree. All right, so we've got all the puree inside the clear cups. So mine filled up five full cups. I'm gonna go ahead and ditch a sixth one. However, I'm gonna go ahead and insert some more strawberries around the sides just to give it a little bit more decor and more of a strawberry feel and flavor. So the next step, we're gonna go ahead and place some foil on top of the cups before we put them inside the freezer. Add some of these popsicle sticks 
into all of these cups. All right, just go ahead and just shove it right on top of the foil, just like so. All right, now it is time to place these in the freezer for about three to four hours. So the popsicles have been in the freezer for about four hours and they should be ready. Check that out. Anyways, we're gonna go ahead and set them up and we're gonna see exactly how they're looking like. So there you have it. That is exactly how you make these incredible strawberry protein popsicles. So of course, I had to garnish it with some Mike and Ike hard candy on top. But guys, these are absolutely delicious, super easy to make. You are going to absolutely love them. And of course, they've got protein in them, so it's gonna help you rebuild and recover. So make sure you check out the new My Protein Clear Way Isolate, 80 calories with 20 grams of protein. Give this recipe a try. Tag us on Instagram, and I can't wait. You're gonna enjoy this one.